What's up, guys? Right, guys and welcome back to your back to another video. Today, we're going to DMX Lord Give Me a Sign. Like, uh, I want to do this because you guys haven't heard, which I'm pretty sure you all have the whole world right now. But DMX unfortunately passed away, uh, at the age of 50. And it's just like it, it's just been weighing on my, my heart, my soul, my mind. It's heavy, like, just heavy for me to do some. For me to show some type of love and respect for this man's passing, and because like most kids who grew up young and black, hip hop was a big part of my culture. Hip hop was a big part of who I was, you know, and it was all around me. And of course, I grew up here in DMX. I grew up respecting him. Just seeing a black man being successful and making it was absolutely amazing. And always inspiring. And I'm not gonna I'm not gonna sit here and say I, like I was the biggest DMX fan in the world. Like I knew all of his songs. I didn't I didn't know all his songs. I'm not a lot of people's songs. But the point is like when I heard that he went into the vestibule state and he was rushed to the hospital, I was just even when it first happened, I was just like, damn man, like, I hope I hope he pulled through. And the unfortunately, you know, he, he did it. He didn't pull through. And the world lost another Icon, another talented musician, and that's to me is really what the sad part is about all this. The fact that we lost such a talent, and that guy's a gentleman that we lost somebody so talented that the world is never going to be able to hear him again. I mean, we'll always have his music, but hear anything hear him speak in person again it, it it's just sad so i had to do something and i wanted to react to two songs because i did one x going to give it to me and i wanted to react to this one lord give me a sign because as much as dmx was a great you know raw gangster and hard rapper and spit everything he was also a spiritual person and he also you know was you know one with god so I'm really looking forward to this. I haven't heard it before, but I know it's gonna be dope, guys. So we're just right into it. Sorry about the weird intro, but I, I want to speak on that. If you guys like me, so be and thanks for subscribing, share the bit of the video as well as her as well as my social media down below. Make sure to let me know your thoughts down in the comment section and where things you're reacting to from DMX and what your opinion because I really hope I'm gonna get a good reaction for them. But let's get into it. Got the legs right here with my phone. Let me so we get keep it on. Yeah, uh, in the name of Jesus. Yes. No weapon formed against me shall prosper. Preach. And every tongue that rises against me in judgment, thou shalt Preach. condemn. Lord, give me a sign. For this is the heritage of the service of the Lord. Preach. And that righteousness is of me, said the Lord. Preach. Amen. Uh. Lord, give me a sign. I really need to talk to you, Lord. Since the last time we talked, the walk has been hard. Now I know you haven't left me, but I feel like I'm alone. I'm a big boy now, but I'm still not grown. And I'm still going through it. Pain and a hurt. Soaking up trouble like rain in the dirt. And I know only I can stop the rain with just a mention of my Savior's name. In the name of Jesus. Devil, I rebuke you for what I go through and trying to make me do what I used to. But all that stops right here. As long as the Lord's in my life, I will have no fear. I will know no pain. From the light to the dark I will show no shame Spit it right from the heart Cause it's right from the start You held me down And there's nothing they can tell me now Lord, give me a sign Let me know Man, that is incredible, man To This is a song about him, you know Asking God to give him a sign To give him a sign of, Like he's doing the right ring That God still have his, you know, his back And I've said this before The way DMX just The way he would just Command and just Deliver on the song was always amazing. Even still, to have that that kind of aggression on this type of song, it's to me it's just crazy because it really grabs you. And this is one of the reasons you know why I'm not. I don't. You know, religion sometimes is the, isn't the best thing. It's a lot of bad things have religion, but sometimes this is this is like why I don't mind because you know. When you grow up going the way he did, growing like you know he was abused by his mother. He was. On the street, just fighting his mind every day. He was on like he was living a hard life. And something like that, you feel alone. You feel like you don't have anybody. 
And that's when you need sometimes you need to you need to have somebody with more strength than you. And that's why I don't mind when people that people believe in God and they believe, you know, in a higher power of some form. Because sometimes you need that. You need that comfort to know that you, that you're not alone, that there is something, something greater than you, you know, looking out for you. And just to hear him the song, hear him like he say, I'm a big boy now, but I'm not still grown. But I'm not but I'm, but I'm still not grown. And, you know, and that's one of the things I want to talk about, because just because you get old doesn't mean you're stopped growing. Doesn't mean because you never stop growing. And by growth, I mean your character. I mean, by your life experience, what you go through, you know, you never stop growing. Even you hit adult age. And he said, the pain and hurt so on trouble like a rain in the dirt. I really, like, because DMX did go, he, get, he went through a lot of trouble, a lot of concentration with the drugs, you know, and of course, all the kids and, and the baby mama and him filing for bankruptcy and being broke, you know, all that stuff, you know. It, and it always seemed like trouble was just around the corner for him, like, because just as much success that he had, like, there was trouble, there's going to be just as much trouble that behind him. And that's not just with him, that's what a lot of people, I think people, you know, now that they look at people in the entertainment industry, as them, oh, they don't go through things, they have all this money, all this fame, but it's like, they go through more problems than maybe some of us do on, on a regular day, some of us who aren't rich and famous. Just because that they are that. Just because the world does know their name and they're always watching their moves and they're waiting to fail. They're waiting to watch them to fail. You know, and so there's always troubles that follows a person like that. Especially a person like this who was who went through so many trials in his life and was still battling things as he was older. He was as even when he was famous, there were still things that he was battling. You know? So I love the fact in the song he's really talking about like, hey, like I need you to tell me, to show me that I'm doing this right, that I'm, you know, that I'm living my life right. Like you said, that's what I'm speaking for, what I go to, for me, what I've tra been trying to make me do what I used to do. Because you got to know, DS used to, he used to rob people. He used to, you know, be in the streets and stuff, you know, and him asking, you know, God for help, like, please help me be something to not go back to that. And that's something so real because a lot of times, you know, people in life, you know, they want to try to better themselves. But when things get hard, it's like sometimes it's like, yeah, I want to go back to what I used to be doing because that way seemed easier. It seemed easier that way instead of doing it the right way, which sometimes might be the hard way. No shame, spit it right from the heart, cause it's right from the start. You held me down and they, nothing they can tell me now. Lord, give me a sign. Let me know what's on your mind. Let me know what I'm gonna find. It's all in time. Show me how to teach the mind. Show me how to reach the blind. Lord, give me a sign. Show me what I got to do to bring me closer to you. Cause I'm gonna go yeah. do whatever you want me to. Just let me know what to do. Lord, give me a sign. Show me something. I'm tired of talking to him, knowing he fighting. Cry about life ain't nothing. But you either be the one mad because you trapped or the one hunting. I'm trapped in your own mind, Damn. waiting on the Lord. Yeah. I'm hunting with the word that cuts like a sword. The spoken word is stronger than the strongest man. Carries the whole world like the strongest hand. Yeah. 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 the tribulations, you never let us down. Jesus, I know you're here with us now. Jesus, I know you're still with us now. Keep it real with us now. I want to feel, show me how. Please let me take your hand. I walk slow, but stay right beside me. Please. Devil's trying to find me. Please. Hide me. Hold up. I take that back. Protect me and give me the strength to fight. Give me a sign. Let me know what's on your mind. Let me know what I'm going to find. It's all in time. Show me how to teach the mind. Show me how to reach the blind. Lord, give me a sign. Show me what I got to do to bring me closer to you. Because I'm going to go through whatever you want me to. Just let me know what to do. Lord, give me a sign. I forget.
All right, guys, that's the real. I hope you guys join me in day. I'm just like, how do you, how do you like do that type of song but still be so raw in it, man? Like, and it really feels like DMX could have been a preacher in another life because, like, he had to be because, like, to be able to talk like that but still have that raw aggression that makes people listen, man, it's. It's absolutely amazing. I really like the one my he said, please show me some tired talking to him, knowing he from crying about life ain't nothing. You, you be mad because you're one trap or the one hunting. Trap your own mind waiting for the Lord or hunting with the word that cuts like the sword. Or hunting with the word that cuts like the sword. I really, really, really like that line. That this is this, that that whole that whole the whole second verse, man, was just was just incredible. Because it really feels like that sometimes it feels like you know you're just you're just trapping your own self doubt, your own fears, your own darkness, your own pain, your own struggles, waiting for somebody, something to come save you, to come take you out of it. Like you said, like you said, oh, let me listen, let me take your hand, guide me. I'll slow walk, but stay right but slow. I'll slow walk, but stay right beside me. Devil trying to find me, hide me, hold up, I take it back, but check me, give it fight back. And I really like that because sometimes it's just easier to hide. It's just easier to hide, to ignore, to ignore the world, to ignore the pain, to ignore what's going on, instead of going out there and try to fight. Instead of going out there and try to beat, it's easier to run away. It's easier to run away and hide, you know, from that. And I love that line because he's saying, like, you know, it's sometimes you have to just stand up and fight back. And again, that's why I said I don't, as a person who grew up Christian, like, there's a reason, there's a reason why I believe in God, because sometimes it takes believe in a higher power, believe in something greater than yourself to give you the strength to be able to do that because you know you're not alone. And like I said, for someone like DMX who was going, who had went through so many trials, tribulations before he was famous and why he was famous, you know, I'm pretty sure there are many times that like, he felt alone despite with all the people and all the, all the posses around him and stuff and his, you know, his boys, you know, despite that, there probably were times where he really felt alone and it was God that helped him Get through those struggles. I helped him build the live to the next day. And the fact that, and the fact that this song resonates with people so well because I feel like they're they're playing time. I know time myself where we all ask, you know, God to give us a sign to let us know the things will be, be okay or let us know that I'm doing. The, am I going down the right path or am I doing wrong? Let me know that you're still here having me. And and that's the thing, you know, we ask for signs, but God never leaves. He never leaves us. You know, it never it never leaves us. You know, it's it's always here watching. The, it's always around us. You know, God is everything. So it this is a song that can relate to so many people because, like I said, we're all sometimes looking for a sign that the way that that things that hopefully things work out that things are going to be okay. You know, as a person who grew up myself, I grew up going through being homeless and many other <laughs> many other situations. Man, that sometimes just it it makes you cry. I remember back then, like you know asking god like where are you like show me that you're still here show me that you still love me show me you still have my back and you know sometimes it's it, it you just need that you need to ask that question because you feel so alone in that moment that you don't know that you have to ask is god still here even though he's always been here and and it's, and it's everywhere but anyway guys that's it i hope you guys enjoy if you did make sure to give me a thumbs subscribe and share there'll be a link in the description of the Video as well as my social media. Please follow me here. Please let me know your thoughts on the little reaction. Like every hit. Did I do a good reaction? Let me know what are your thoughts, what are your opinions. Uh, RIP to DMX, man. You were a legend and you were sure to be missed. So, Wars lost a treasure with you. But let me know your thoughts, guys. This is a I'm out. Peace.